real reason why Protoss is a bullshit A-move race is the Zealot. The Zealot is too strong, the Zealot's so power, the Zealot is broken, and the Zealot makes every build a lot stronger. Guys, is there a problem with the Zealot? The Zealot? The Zealot. Uh, Imagine no. for a second a seven foot tall, biologically engineered <laughs> post human in powered armor carrying a space advanced nail gun shooting projectiles at subsonic speeds, hitting both air and ground. Then take your mind and add drugs to it that quadruples their speed, makes them move faster, shoot faster, which doesn't make sense, by the way. Why would you shoot a gun faster if you're on drugs? Is the gun taking the drugs? Are you clicking it faster? Could you not just click it faster any fucking ways? Why do the drugs affect the gun? Imagine this guy, take the cost. You'd say, Jeff, it's got to cost twice what a zealot does because a zealot fucking can only punch things up close with its side blades that it generates out of its mind. No, it's half the cost. And you literally make them at the beginning of the game. Well, we're like, well, surely they fall off later in the game. They get better. <laughs> They're the counter to the capital ship of the Protoss. And when I say capital ship, I mean literally a city flying above the planet. The space marine on drugs shoots everything it has into the sky, and then the capital ship becomes a blimp. What do you mean a blimp, Jeff? I mean literally a fucking blimp. It has no attacks. It can every six minutes make another interceptor to get shot by a tier one space marine with a drug-induced gun. The Zealot? If you're bitching about a Zealot, I've got... Such terrible news for you. There's gravity on Earth, and it must be crushing your weak, puny ass. Get off the ground, stop whining, and play Terran. Fuck yeah. off, seriously, the zealot. <laughs> Insane. <laughs>